Yeah, I mean, it's not impossible for DMX to catch up. I mean, we did see him go, as you said, mentioned earlier. I mean, he's going roughly in the same direction. Yeah, I mean, I definitely do think he has a lot of ground to co cover up. Kiri was sure. in the ocean for a very long time, so it's probably going to be a while before we see DMX um, anywhere near the stronghold. But still, like, he's still in the... Oh, no. He's still winning he's the... He's some gym. damage here. Oh, oh, oh no. The silverfish. Still... Yeah, the silverfish. He's, oh, oh. he's found, this... he's found oh, the floor. Okay. He's found the floor. Oh my gosh. Wait, it's a zero Why Does Kiri have enough? No, he does. He does. I, I'm pretty sure he has enough. Does he have enough? Yes, he does. Okay, he's good. Oh, okay. oh my gosh. Take some damage. But he's going in the end. Oh, he just barely he's... has enough. If one of his eyes broke, he doesn't have enough glaze powder. So if one of his, if an extra eye broke, he would have been done. I'm just hoping he's warmed up to the other kinds of one cycles because personally, like, it's really easy oh to get used to one scratch. How is he gonna? Oh, how is he gonna do this? You know, he can't do water log. That's that was literally Kiri's like thing of this tournament that I've realized um, compared to any other runner. I think Kiri was the first runner to like really do water log strats. I, yeah, I really like. I, I like. Was, yeah, I, I really like it. I really. He like was. That. He was the first runner that I saw use them. Like he's very like that's his strat. Like he knows how to do them well. So he's going for slabs. I mean, he's probably practiced this. I'm sure he's practiced um, it. But I hope. But like, I, 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 from my experience, slabs and you know when you jump and place the bed, that that's very like it's very chokeable, right? You can misplace the bed, you can misplace oh, yeah. the jump, whatever, or you know, you not misplace the jump, but you know what I mean. You know, it's very like easy to mess that up, if especially if you're not warmed up to it. So I'm just worried, I'm a little worried here, but it looks like he might get a quick Is perch. Is that a perch? Kiwi's perches are really something uh, interesting to, to see. He's been getting really good perches. So this is this is this looks like it's gonna be it. Let's see if he can pull off the the slab yeah. one cycle. If he fails this, oh, it comes down to this. Yeah, this is really the deciding factor of the entire. Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens. If he misses this, the DMX can easily catch oh, up. And he's going for the he's going for Ooh. the sideways strat, which is okay. Okay, this is good. This is good. I I, I think he's probably practiced this. Okay, let's oh see what happens. Oh my gosh, it's fine. Let's let's see. First bed good. Second bed good. Third bed good, fourth bed good. Okay, he's doing great here. Very well played. Oh, and I think that's gonna be a carry who takes game three and advances on the losers bracket. Very, very close game. What? But he, he he pulled it. Well, not very close. That one was a little bit farther, but but still very good. GG well played to both runners. Man, that was a very intense game of life. That was crazy. Uh, can I just say, I did not know. I thought I was the only one who did sideways perch strats. So, shout out to Kiryu. I didn't know anyone else did that. 